more Vitruvians. Before the vain faith, our people held dualism as truth. Look at this. The Zariman. Mind and body. Consciousness and matter. Of our world. And the void. It was from there that our answer finally came. Yep, this is what the spaceship looks like. See here? Zoriman 010. This is it. And if you remember the uh, trailer for the Duviri Paradox, this is what you see far away in the horizon. Sort of like shape-shifted by the void. Oh, that's gonna be so cool. Distorted by vague horrors, we kept the Zoriman survivors within a secret reservoir. They were the missing half. Transference linked. The warframes, the body. And they, the mind. I give you now the coordinates and codes to this place. But do not underestimate these devils on how. They did what we could not. We had created monsters we could... I know what I have to do. Operator? I don't need to hear it. I lived it. Prep the landing craft, Ortis. I'm going in. Myself. I hope that doesn't mean what I think it does. Without my Warframe? Oh boy. I gotta go confront Umbra. As myself. Woo! Back to Lua. Man oh man oh man. All right, it's time to have mind sex. I'm gonna jump inside your mind and I'm gonna dig around in there. You know how dangerous this is. The sentience will be here in force. This is why you bring a warframe to these things. My warframe is here. I just have to find it. Oh, that's cute. Also, you have a shit amp. Have you thought about that? Advise you approach with caution. And now I have to deplete his shield, but without a warframe. No, don't run away from me. I'm gonna shoot you with my shit amp. Let me shoot you with my shit amp. Come on. Come on. We're gonna do this for like, you know, half an hour or so. There we go. Ah, oh, he killed me. Now I have to look at this animation. Now I'm back. Aha! I teleported away from you. Yeah, I know, I know, I know he killed me again. <laughs> Riveting gameplay. No. I'm sorry, DE, but this is... This is just like... This is something people do... Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, th this mission is a necessary evil in most people's mind. It's not something you ever, ever want to replay. Because trust me when I say this, this is not a fun encounter. He can even see me when I'm invisible. That's garbage. And then he does the stun thing. Right? I mean, I... And then, oh, I'm dead again. But I'm not actually dead. I'm just in this little thing. So there's no stakes here. He can't actually kill me. He can just sort of like stun me for a while. And then I have to recharge my stuff. And, ugh. <sighs> and then we just go through this song and dance again. See, I should just let him kill me, right? Like this. Instead of trying to run away. Because now I at least get things lined up. So I can just empty this thing. Right into him. And then he can cut me down again. And then we again have a straight line where I have a full energy thing. And I'll just shoot him like this. Oh! Dude! I said I'm gonna shoot you like this. And like I, I'm sorry, but this is not well designed. It's not. Because there is there is absolutely nothing fun 
about doing this. It's the opposite of fun. I am having a bad time right here. And I think everyone who's played this mission had a bad time here. I don't think anyone enjoyed this. I honestly don't think they did. So that's poor. Whoa, that's bugged out. Ah, there we go. But our minds are linked now. We'll face this together. Oh boy, I'm transforming. This poison he's given you, it has taken your will away. You are a victim as much as your son. Ah, oh, look at that little smirk. Ballas is very happy about what's gonna happen here. See, you gotta let him have some good hatred in his heart, so he'll be nice and aggressive when you set him on to your enemies, right? That was the plan, I guess, before they learned how to... Well, no, not before, because like, Umbra is one of the later creations. Uh, the Warframes and the Tenno and all that... War Ballas created all of that while he was still, you know with the Orokin, when he was just an Orokin executor. Uh, Umbra was created later. Umbra was created, uh, like, well after Ballas had, uh, decided to betray the Orokin. This is just a cruel joke on Ballas's part. Because, uh, it is inferred that the Dax that became Umbra, um, was on to him and was starting to figure out that Ballas was going to betray the Orokin. So he turned him into a Warframe just to make sure that he wouldn't talk. <laughs> Which is so, so messed up. He could have just killed him, but instead he did this because Ballas is a, a, a psychopath. He is horrible. We had created monsters we couldn't control. We drugged them, tortured them, eviscerated them. We brutalized their minds, but it did not work until they came. But it was not their force of will, not their void devilry, not their alien darkness. It was something else. It was that somehow, Within the derelict horror, they had learned a way to see inside an ugly, broken thing and take away its pain. Ah, see, that's what we're doing. The being a Warframe is just never ending agony, uh, except for the times when they just let an operator control them as well or I mean instead that's like the the only time where they are actually sort of at peace because that's 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 messed up man Ballas, why are you the way you are we return this memory to the void and find peace in our emptiness hmm and now we have a new Warframe with a nice looking scarf and a cool sword. Oh boy! 
And now we gotta do some fight fights. Uh, and I'm so bad at playing uh, Excalibur. Your transference signal is clean. Synchronized with that warframe. Mark a path to extraction. We've got one last mission before this is done. Marking, but I'm detecting a mass of sentient forces converging on the location. Great. You may be able to escape. No. Let them come. But I don't have any mods. And I don't have any weapons. All I have is this sword. Which, you know, admittedly does ow, 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 a decent amount of damage. Uh, let's see. What do I got? Uh, do I have something to, to deal with? Aha! Exalted Blade. Exalted Blade is really good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Excalibur's thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll just slash everything. Slash for days. And you know what? Let's just remove their damage destruction. See that? See that? I'm uh, I'm in operator mode. And he's just doing shit. That's the difference between Excalibur, Umbra, and every other Warframe in the game. Uh, he acts independently of the operator. When I go into operator mode... Um, Umbra will not just be standing there like any other Warframe. He will move and fight by himself. How cool is that? That's so goddamn cool. However, I proved my point. Now me and my Warframe that ah, doesn't have any mods or weapons besides this sword are gonna get out of here while we can. Because this is still... Yeah, this is a real fight. This is a real goddamn fight. We are not equipped for it. Woo! We gotta get out of here. We gotta get out! <laughs> Ow. Okay, we did it. And we got our cool new Warframe. He is cool. He's way cooler than the normal Excalibur. You gotta admit. You know why? Because he's black. That's why. He's got that soul power. Yeah. <laughs> Operator, you have no idea what Ballas is capable of. Please reconsider this. Why would you risk it? Ortis, I'd like to hear her. Yes. Yes, of course. Accessing data store. Which should I play? Hmm. We're going dark. Dark, dark, dark. My child, so beautiful to behold. How do you feel? Operation I feel good. Much to be done. Please consult the navigation console. Yeah, but before we return to Earth, okay? Let's put some mods in here. Look at this. Look at what this guy got. Well, look at what we have now. The Umbral mods. Uh, ability strength, armor, health, and they can be upgraded quite a lot. And they have a specific polarity called the Umbra Polarity, uh, which is just for these mods. And if you don't have it, they are kind of rough to uh, to slot into your Warframe. They're going to take uh, a lot of mod space, which is why you do the Nightwave stuff, because you get an Umbra Forma where you can give an Umbra Polarity to your Warframe. You know, you know what that is? That is good. So this guy comes with an... Uh, Roken Reactor. It's got three Umbra slots. Um, it is just a, a very, very powerful Warframe here. And uh, Intensify is great. Oh, right. I already have the Umbra to Intensify. Ha, 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 ha. Don't even need that. Ability duration. I don't know. What do you want on this? That's uh, ability strength. Duration for the Radial Howl. Let's see. Shed Sentient Resistance. Yeah, sure. Radial Javelin, 
Uh, it's probably good with uh, increased range. An exalted blade. Exalted blade has drain per second, right? So you don't want that. Uh, you want continue the streamline. Yeah, yeah, you want streamline. You want it to cost less per second. That's pretty good. And and uh, continuity duration. Yeah, we can get that in there as well. And how about some? Oh, he's got so much armor. Oh, let's give him some more armor. Oh, right, because of the umbral fiber. Well, you know what? You know what? We have armored agility. Mmm, more armor. And I guess we'll just give him some health and stuff, because I don't feel like I need to fiddle around with him right now. I'm just going to give him, like, health and shields. All right, I, I already have that. God, what do I give him? I guess I can give him more range. Just to make him, you know, good at everything for now. There. Bam. Look at that. Good at everything. Excellent. And now I'm going to fiddle a bit with the colors. Now we got our proper Orokin-looking Excalibur Umbra here, right? Yeah. Mmm. Look at that white, black, and gold. That's fancy. This, this is an Excalibur Umbra that you can be proud of. This is a guy who's ready to go to war. Put all the mods in him as well. Here we go. We shall do this thing. We shall do this thing once and for all. And that'll be that. Good commentary. Well done, Nick. Give yourself a pat on the back for that one. Mm -mm -mm. Alright. He is waiting for you, but I'm detecting powerful signals emanating from the courtyard. They are calling out for reinforcements across the entire system. You don't have long. Well. That's fine. Here, I'll show you just how fine it is. Oh yeah. See that? That is a Zord that's got all the good stuff in it. And uh, the sword he has uses like those Umbral mods as well. Uh, extra like sentient damage, stuff like that. So like, you just... I just go through them. Like a hot knife through butter. And like, I recognize that these guys are tough. I understand. Hey, look at that! Umbra is helping out. It's neat. Me and him. Just kicking ass. Just a couple of clowns. So I wonder, are these guys just gonna keep on spawning in forever? I don't know. I don't know if they will. Whoops. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Guys, don't do me like that. Thank you, Umbra. I'm just gonna be here and remove their damage resistance. And you can take them out with with the flamethrower, right? Yeah, and the sword. And the sword. The flamethrower and the sword. Both are good. Alright. Enough mucking around. We are here to confront Ballas, and that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna ignore all of these sentients now. We don't have to fight them. Whee! Ballas, I see you! I tried to release you from your torment, but it seems those devils rebuilt you. What have you done with her? Ballas, where is the Lotus? Has the wolf become a dog? Is this Umbra or some Tenno? Both. Then both will burn. Excuse me? Ow. All right, you know what? Not cool. I'm gonna do this. Yeah, exalted blade. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cut them down, cut them down. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. That did not go as well as I'd planned. Oh, no. 
Damn it. I forgot that I suck at playing Excalibur. Let's remove their damage resistances. Yeah. And let's do that again. Ha ha ha. And it also stuns them. Wow, that's cool. Ow, ow, ow. Yeah, yeah, let's just, let's just howl. Let's just howl at the moon. See? All is well. More of them? Gotcha. Howl! Hey, you were supposed to be stunned when I did that. Mmm. So good at screaming, isn't he? He is a screamy boy. I like these stuns. They do the trick just nicely. And then they remove the, the damage resistance. I like that. I like that. I can work with this. But seriously though, why are there so many of you? Have you tried not being so many? Alright, is that the last one? I hope so. Alright, Ballas, I, I killed I killed Stop. your mates. Oh no, not this again. You think you can defy me? Not even your Tenno devil can defy. Oh, how about that? Well, couldn't have happened to a nicer guy. God, your arm is so icky. See, I like that this is the uh, the so-called light answer here. No, because these are not like good or bad, so so it's fine. It's fine. I'm gonna go dark. I like dark. Dark is good. The cycle is broken. Nihilism. Yeah. Now I know what she sees in you. Ah oh, no, there's so many of them. Where is she? Where is the lotus? Well, you know, remember how Hoon Hao referred to uh, the Lotus as his daughter? All that talk about how, you know, how she was a sentient and all of that. Oh, guess what? Guess she really is. I saw her, Ortis. But it wasn't her, was it? No. I'm going to say it was. I, I don't know. But I'm going to find out. How about that? How about that? But in the end, we got a shiny new buddy out of it. So that's cool. Look at him. He's our shiny new buddy. Now... Even though we don't have anything left here on the um, on the quest log, we're not quite done yet. 
We're not quite done yet. Uh, I, yeah, 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 I know, I know. The Mask of the Revenant, that's a tiny little thing. Otherwise, it, it would sort of look like we don't have anything left. But we do. We do have a little bit of a thing left. Let's go back to our living quarters, shall we? Right. So you got the lotus mask here. Okay. That's a thing. So we're not done yet. That's a thing. We can't interact with it yet. There are uh, prerequisites. Um, you know how you know this? You know it by looking at this. There is a node here. The, the Ropala list, see? You must complete Chimera Prologue in order to access this location. So that there, there is more main quest. It's called the Chimera Prologue and then the Ropalalist boss fight. Those are the only two main quest related things that we have not yet done. Um, Operator, Ordis wonders, what are you thinking about? So that's next up. And also we have the, the Mask of the Revenant thing. Uh, once we've done that, once we've done Mask of the Revenant and uh, Chimera Prologue and the, the Ropala list, uh, we have reached like the end of the line for, for the story content that exists in the game today. So when that happens, I'm probably going to uh, shift accounts. I'm going to sort of abandon this account that I created uh, for this Let's Play series. And then I'm going to move over to my main account. And I'm going to be using that to feature all, all future Warframe content. Because, you know, there's not going to be any point for me to play with two different accounts anymore. Isn't that cool? So we're, we're getting there. We are slowly but surely getting there. Oh man, I'm excited about that. Alright, next up. Next up, we got the Chimera Prologue. And we got... Our Kuva Lich <laughs> to deal with. So those things are gonna happen. Yeah. Woo!